Ruby and today I'm going to be showing you an updated school night routine. This video has been so highly requested and I'm really excited to share it with you. This video is actually sponsored by The Great Courses Plus. This is a subscription that you can sign up to and then you get access to video lectures and these are by university professors, there are individuals from National Geographic, the Smithsonian, and basically you are able to watch these lectures on demand. You can either watch them or you can listen to them. Since being able to work with them um, and since I've had access to these lectures, I have just loved it. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you will know how much I value productivity and being able to listen to these lectures when you are doing something else so you're able to multitask and so you feel like you're getting the most out of your time. I will be mentioning The Great Courses Plus again later in the video so without further ado I hope that you enjoy my night routine. So I usually get home from school at about 4.30 and when I get in I like to open up the window in my bedroom just to get some fresh air because my room is often quite stuffy when I get home from school and then I will just sit down at my desk and do some general school admin so I will reply to my school emails and plan for meetings that kind of thing because I usually have quite a lot to do and I will do that until about five. So then at five I will plan my study session and usually I will use my pumpkin productivity study planner, however today I decided to make a mind map. So today I actually decided to try out a new method of planning my evening study sessions which is doing an hour for each of my A-level subjects. So I started off with English and just did well, I finished this research on the cool, which I started in my study period. And then I went and ate dinner, and I eat dinner so early at about 5.30. I just really like to eat early. This evening for dinner, I just had some baked beans, potato waffles, and falafel. And then of course I went and washed my hands, which I do beforehand as well, by the way. Um, so then I went and actually started my hour long timer for English and I was just writing some journey's end notes here. This isn't going to be a full study with me so I don't film all of the studying that I did this evening because it's a night routine and not a study with me, uh, but I decided to film some of it. So then here I was just writing some poetry notes And then I decided to go through my journey's end notes. And then after that, I just added to my journey's end key moments again, which I'd started earlier. And this is all of the studying that I did for English. That was an hour of English work. And I didn't film my chemistry and RS because otherwise I knew that this would just be such a long video. So I really try my best to finish studying from 9 to 9.30. Um, this evening I finished at 9.30 and once I am finished I will just go through and tidy my bedroom because it does get really messy when I study. Then I will head downstairs and the reason that we have this photo frame in front of the staircase at the moment is because we recently got a new puppy and she keeps on climbing upstairs. This doesn't happen every evening, but the, today my mum had baked a bakeful tart, so I came downstairs to have some of that with some milk. And of course I just have to sort out the fridge whilst I'm down there because things always get put back in the wrong place. So then I was just reading my book as I ate the delicious bakeful tart. So then one thing I like to do in the evenings is make myself a mug of tea. So I am drinking this one from the Match Reserve again. As you know, this is my favourite tea company. This is the Sleeping Beauty Tox, which they sent me recently and which is so relaxing to have before bed. So I just fill that up and then I will put it in my bedroom to cool whilst I go and have my shower. 
depending on the time of day, sometimes I will exercise at this point, but because I finished work at 9.30 instead of 9, I didn't get time to do that. So then I will head to the bathroom and take out my contact lenses. And then I will go and have a shower. I'm just going to go through and show you the products which I use. So I use the Aveda Clove Shampoo, the Banana Conditioner and this Drops of Youth um, facial wash from the body shop which basically you rub on your skin and it exfoliates it and all of the dead skin comes off. You can't really see it in the clip but it's really cool. So when I got out of the shower I decided to put on a lecture from The Great Courses Plus. In human life. Religion in the ancient world was a way of worshipping these gods. The Great Courses Plus offers 10,000 different video lectures and there are so many to choose from, from so many different topics. The one I was listening to today was called Beginnings of the Canon and it's basically about how Orthodox Christian scripture and the Bible actually came about. It's so interesting, especially as a religious studies student. So I was listening to this on my phone, but Great Courses Plus also offers the option of listening to it on a tablet or on a laptop, but I usually use my phone. So I was listening to this lecture whilst doing my hair, so I just put on some face cream and then I brushed out my hair. I love listening to things whilst I'm doing other things because it just makes me feel more productive and listening to lectures especially when they are so informative feels like such a great use of, use of my time honestly. So I don't do this every evening but if I do wash my hair I sometimes like to braid my hair so I just put my hair into two plaits. I like to do my plaits quite tight because it means that my hair is wavy in the morning. So then I will turn off my lecture and head to the bathroom so as to brush my teeth and usually I will read my book at this time but sometimes I will finish listening to the lecture instead. It just depends on my mood. So then when I get back into my bedroom I will just reply to a few YouTube comments and also some general YouTube admin emails. So then I will finally get into bed. And one thing I like to try and do every evening is watch the Daily 8 Passengers vlog because it's just so uplifting and I really love the videos. So then every night without fail I will spray my bed with this White Company Pillow Mist. As I said before it is my favourite toiletry product of all time, uh, I can hardly get to sleep without it. So then, of course, I will read, and at the moment I'm reading Aristotle and Dante, Discover the Secrets of the Universe, which is amazing. You have to read it if you haven't already. And then I will also write in my journal. I like to write to my log every evening, and I also try to write in my two five-year journals. Um, so thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. So there are a few last things that I want to say about The Great Courses Plus. So you can visit thegreatcoursesplus.com slash Granger and that will be linked down in the description box if you want to go and take a look at the website. I do honestly recommend the service. I'm not just saying that, I can say that truthfully. Otherwise I would not be working with them and advertising them in a video. There is also the possibility to have a free trial of the service if you're not sure whether you will like it, if you're not sure whether you will use it. So I will leave a link to the free trial as well down below if you want to go and have a look. I have honestly been listening to them so much. I particularly like the ones on the history of Christianity because there are quite a few on the development of Christian thought and since I study religious studies I found it's actually really helpful um, and I've actually been able to apply it to essays as well but mostly it's great for learning about things you don't get to learn about on school specifications. It's about enriching your learning 
outside of school, outside of specifications. Um, so all details will be linked down below. Thank you again and have a productive week.